Paranthropus robustus is an extinct species of hominin, and thus belongs to the hominini, or human-like apes. It lived between 2.6 and 1.1 million years ago. A fossilized skull of its skull was first discovered in South Africa in 1938. It had huge jaws for chewing tough vegetation like roots and tubers. It was not a direct ancestor of humankind, but an ancient cousin. Paranthropus was well adapted to a specialized, mainly vegetarian, diet. As environmental conditions changed it therefore may have been unable to adapt to changes in the available food. Or it may have been wiped out by a species-specific disease. Its decline to extinction also may have been hastened by the presence of a competitor, the early species of the genus Homo. Homo habilis, one of the first hominids in the Homo lineage, was more adaptable and omnivorous, and developed the facility to make stone tools. Homo habilis survived, while Paranthropus, which was not a toolmaker, became extinct about 1 million years ago. Paranthropus discoveries at the cradle of humankind signaled a major shift in thinking about evolution. It became clear that human evolution was not a single chain of adaptations. It was more like a tree or bush of parallel lineages. Some lineages were successful, or able to adapt to changing environments, while others were not and became extinct. As these hominids walked upright and lived at about the same time as our direct predecessors in the Homo genus, Homo habilis and Homo ergaster. Modern humans are not descended from Paranthropus. Although Paranthropus was bipedal, there are many differences between us and it. The most marked differences are in the cranial anatomy. Paranthropus is described as robust, in the sense that it was heavily built with a broad and heavy skull. In particular, it had very large sagittal cranial crests, resembling those of the gorilla, indicating that it had powerful chewing muscles. It also had broad teeth, and both these features suggest that it lived on a diet of hard vegetable matter, perhaps including grubs. The robust Australopithecines, including Paranthropus, are a sister group of the line that lead to humans the name Paranthropus means beside human. An offshoot of the lineage leading to humanity, it was not a direct ancestor, but more like a distant cousin. With the discovery of Paranthropus, Scientists realized that the evolutionary path to modern humankind was not a simple sequence in which one set of human ancestors evolved over time, in a neat chain of progression. It is a complicated and still contested family tree. With many branches breaking off as species of ancestral relatives became extinct, the three robust species, Ethiopicus, Boisei, and Robustus, were recognized as being different enough from the other Australopithecines and similar enough to each other to be placed into a separate genus, Paranthropus. The question, which species did Paranthropus robustus evolve from? Did Paranthropus robustus evolve from Paranthropus ethiopicus? Or were there regionally distinct robust Australopithecine lineages? Meaning Paranthropus robustus evolved from the other Southern African species Australopithecus africanus?